All right, so what we're gonna be making is a tailing redfish today. So this is based on a uh, tequila-based cocktail uh, with the uh, inspiration behind Sightline Provisions tailing redfish uh, piece. All right, so we're gonna start off. We've got our shaker fill up, filled with ice already. Uh, we're gonna do one ounce of the reposado. And what are those notes again in the reposado? Reposado has uh, some natural uh, notes of vanilla. Uh, the va uh, vanilla comes from uh, barrel aging in general. Mm -hmm. uh, it's gonna have a little bit of a coconut and some tropical flavors from um, not just the, the the agave itself or the blue agave itself, but mm. because of that barrel aging characteristic that it undergoes. And so it adds a little bit more complexity to the overall cocktail. And we're gonna do one ounce of the Lala Blanco tequila. And the Blanco is an unaged Exactly, tequila. an unaged uh, blue agave tequila. And again, it just um, kind of makes a nice crisp to, to the overall cocktail. Mm -hmm. We're gonna do three, well, we're gonna do one quarter ounce of the real grenadine by our friends over at Liver & Co. They are a local Austin-based syrup company. Uh, when you try something with real grenadine, it's, it's such a game changer in, in, mm -hmm. your, uh, in your cocktail, so. Whenever possible, try to look for it. Like I said, the guys over at Liber & Co, mm -hmm. they just do everything so right. So mm -hmm. definitely look that up. Uh, and then this is, uh, again, that oleosaccharum uh, syrup. Um, oleosaccharum is, a, um, is made with citrus peel and sugar. So what we did was I took uh, grapefruit peel, lemon peel, uh, added a lot of sugar to those peels and then just let that, uh, muddle that all together and kind of let that sit for a few hours. And this is about three quarters of an ounce. Can I smell that? Yeah, absolutely. Oh God, that's good. Yeah, it's just real the, fresh. The, yeah, bright right? citrus. Right, right, that's and that nice. big red would have been fine, Yeah. but it's just not, it doesn't have that fresh fruit flavor, mm -hmm. right? Mm -hmm. um, it, it has a lot of those undertones of what we want, but it's just not there. Uh, so then we'll just uh, shake this. Try not to. I'll just strain this. Over the rocks. And then we're gonna add a little blue curacao to the top of the drink. And this is for, not just for the color, uh, but flavor as well. The color, if you remember your redfish tail has a little bit of a blue tinge to it. And that's what that's supposed to represent. Very nice. And there it is. That looks delicious. Here you go, sir. All right. <laughs> Oh, that's good. It's bright, it's tasty. Grapefruit, citrusy. Tastes like a, uh, like a spring or a summer evening, actually. It's really yeah, nice. Yeah, 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 as we're coming into Cheers. it. Cheers. Thank you. Thanks for coming out, man. Oh, good. Delighted to be here.